a lot of the spoons that we're using are a little bit smaller size. When we fish down the Bias River on the Pong Reservoir, we're going to be casting large lures because it's big waters. But here you can see the size of the pools aren't that huge, even though there are some fish in here that are 30, 40 pounds. So that's the spoon size. But now let me tell you about the spinners because I'm actually going to change the spinner that I'm using. So if you look, I got a couple boxes here. If you look in this box, not my pink and purple one. If you look in this box, this is where I have all my Vibrex spoons. And uh, some of them have single hooks on them. Some of them have double hooks. I'm going to try going to a bigger one. I've been using a number three. And this is a number four. It still has an orange bell on it. And I just got to take off the snap. Now, the unique thing about a Vibrex spinner is that it has a nice flashy blade, but the key feature is this bell. Notice that inside the bell, there's a gear, and if I spin it, it spins around. The company claims that when it's going through the water and the water goes through the bell, the bell actually oscillates from side to side. And if I were to put this close to my microphone, you might be able to hear the hitting. That's why it's called a Vibrex. You hear that noise? That's the actual bell hitting the gear that's inside. So it's spinning and hitting besides the blade, making a lot of action. 